and welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with another StarCraft II commentary. I am the Red Terran in the southeast up against Crying Devil, the Blue Terran in the northeast. Um, once again, he doesn't answer my good luck, have fun. Oh, there he goes. A little late on it. But he sends one of his first SCVs out on a scouting mission. This is very strange early on. Um, I hate, I don't want to spoil it for you guys, but this game was a nightmare for me, and you will soon see why. So here we go. This is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Um, and he does spot my base right away. Maybe that's why he sent it out. Um, he's already sending it to the to the next base, uh, so then he does change it, uh, moving back in to see what I'm up to. He's getting a very fast refinery here. Still hasn't even gotten a supply depot. He's actually almost maxed out here. Um, he's got 10 units out. Um, he's harassing my SCVs like nobody's business, so I send three out just to make sure nobody dies. And finish off, move back to the minerals. Continuing to get the SCVs. I need to get a barracks out. Um, I'm easily uh, annoyed and distracted, so it is late because he did send that SCV in to harass. And another SCV coming to my base. What is going on? Uh, finally, a an engineering bay. Not even a supply depot. What is he doing? He's completely maxed out here. Uh, sly locked. Uh, can't do anything. Um, he's got three on the gas. Supply depot up. What is going on? I, uh, he's continuing to harass, I think, to make sure I don't scout. Um, but considering that he's got another SCV here, I have to assume he's going for some kind of rush. Um, another refinery going down. What is he doing? Um, so... Some of you may already know, have seen this before. Ah, uh, this was the first time to, for me. I've never seen it in a video. I have never seen it in game. Uh, this was a first. I don't want to spoil it until it actually happens because I was absolutely clueless, and it is obvious that I was clueless. Uh, so Marine coming out before um, any add-on is finished. Uh, just now getting enough for the tech lab, but since he is coming in for all these harasses with one SCV at a time, oh, he lifted off his command center. He loaded up five SCVs in there, um, going for an all-in uh, with all the SCVs. Uh, he's completely abandoned that base. So I'm not sure... You know, while I'm playing this game, I have no idea what's going down. I'm continuing with my normal build. Uh, Orbital Command coming up. Um, and they're going for my barracks. At this point, honestly, I was like, this guy's a total noob. What is he doing? He's going all in with SCVs. Does he not know how to play this game? Um, you know, <laughs> what's going on? Mule going down. Uh, not going too far, and now I do see this base coming in. He put, he's putting it right into my base. What is he doing? That marine will go down again. I don't kill off any SCV, so he still has four left. And there you see it. The the base is landing right next to mine. Um, but I don't see that's where he's going, so I actually build a barracks right next to it. All the SCVs out. He's got nine out now, up against my 17. And here, you can see it's morphing into a planetary fortress. This is known as a planetary fortress rush. I had never seen it. Um, to my knowledge, uh, this is... Uh, not that routine, but it's been seen before. Um, at this point in the game, um, I still thought it was going to be a, an orbital command until I see that turret come up. Um, no, I still think that it's an orbital command. I don't even bother checking. I'd never seen an, a, a, a planetary fortress this fast. The only way to counter this, as far as I know, is early scouting. So there it is. Planetary fortress is fully up. And it's absolutely destroying my SCVs. I go around to try to take it out. There's no point. It will destroy all my SCVs. His SCVs coming in, um, trying to produce as many uh, are, as many Marines as I can. This game was horrible. What was I doing? So I lift off my orbital command, and if you notice, Planetary Fortress can only attack 
ground units. It does 40 damage with a range of 6, but only to ground. That is important, but not something that I noticed. So neither one of us are mining at all. I'm continuing just to get one uh, marine at a time. I do have a ton of uh, minerals, a ton of gas for this early, so I can continue to produce marines. So I go the one place that I know um, won't give him the advantage, and that's his old base. <laughs> so we've actually completed a base switch here. Um, I don't know if that is a counter to the planetary fortress rush or not. That's just something I did uh, because I panicked. Uh, so uh, almost uh, completely uh, gone here is my base. I just have that one refinery left. He is going to try to lure me back into the range of the planetary fortress. Do I fall for it? Yes! No, I do stay right outside the range to take out the, that barracks there. And so he cancels it. I have three marines on the field. That is not going to be enough to take out that planetary fortress. I try to uh, attack this uh, SCV with the mule. As you can see, um, it uh, the, as the mule refuses to do damage. It should be doing seven. Uh, what is it? Seven to five. So this attacks for five. It should be the mule should do seven damage. I'm sorry. That's something you guys need to fix. <laughs> um, because uh, I did sacrifice uh, SCV production to get the mules. I don't know, just a thought. It gives them an attack. Uh, so he's back to the to the Zelnaga Tower. He gets his own barracks uh, below the planetary fortress, so I can't take it out. Um, but I'm continuing to pump uh, Marines. I go below this. I thought was a great move on my part. But he sends the... Uh, can he attack? Uh, but he sends... Oh, there we go. We do go in range of the Planetary Fortress. And, oh, one hit kill. Uh, splash damage is a bitch. Uh, th that was a great move on my part. Keep. I w it would have been great if I had kept the Marines here. Um effectively uh, and put them to hold position that might have won me the game as I continue to macro up back at my base um, if he could only um, you know mine off of half the minerals here I probably uh, looks like he would have only been able to go off of three actually so he would have been all down to less than half of his uh, minerals I do have a second barracks going up sorry about that um, little misclick on my mouse and he does send one marine here to take out the refinery. Would have been great. Uh, I could have done it again. Put the put the marines here. Clicked hold position. You know, right there, hold position. Probably would have won me the game. You know, planetary fortress rush. Um, these players don't typically uh, go that far into games um, if they go for this rush because um, it is very effective. Uh, th really, the only way is prevention. I can't think of a way to counter it once it's in my base uh, besides moving out. Oh, but bad uh, micro, and I do lose the marines. He is able to go in and try go for the barracks with two marines, but they are both in yellow health already, so my two marines, when they come out, they at the same time, because of this reactor, he should be taking out the reactor first. Uh, once these uh, marines are out, and oh, he could have taken them out. There we go. Two marines down, like that. No, he didn't attack me at all. I do finally hold position on them, so he is unable to to lure me into the range of the planetary fortress. As you can see, I've done no damage to it whatsoever. 1355. Uh, but here we go. Huge mistake on my part. I'm still absolutely petrified, so I'm just trying to mass Marines. Uh, I, I'm just like, Marines, Marines, I just need as many troops as I can do as soon as possible. Because I don't know what he's got going on down here. Um, I just know that Planetary Fortress will wreak havoc on me if I go in to look. 
Um, but really, I am in a good position here. I assume that I have the lead. Uh, he does have that engineering bay up, and he's got a couple of refineries, so I'm not mining off of gas anymore. But I still have three, 240 gas there. Um, looks like I built a factory. Um, so are we going to be seeing siege tanks? Siege tanks would also do great against the planetary fortress, as would marauders. But I didn't get marauders. I got a reactor because he scared me. 